Welcome to the Pretty and Profiting Show, your favorite show for branding, beauty, business, and the truth of how to be a boss lady and build your empire. Pause the show right now and grab your free gift at ProfitablePersonalBrand.com slash hot. It's a workbook and audio training on five high-performing strategies to dominate your market and add an extra thousand to ten thousand dollars to your bottom line. And now your host. She's a fierce, creative freaking genius who is known by many as Nikki Hustle. Nicole K. Lundy. Welcome to today's episode. Today, we are talking beauty. And specifically, we're talking about foundation. Foundation perfection. What foundation type is perfect for your skin? So here's the deal. We have all seen a case of the mismatched foundation. It's traumatizing, it's scary, it's so not good. And <laughs> its foundation is like the basis of your makeup look. So if it's off, the whole look is off. So it's a very important part of your makeup routine and it should be treated as such. But where do you start? Color matching is very important, but there are other factors to consider as well as coverage type, texture, and skin type. There are many formulations, trust me, and I'm sure you know, and types of foundations out there. So, you know, in today's episode, I want to help you find the ones that are perfect for you. So we're going to start with the basics, and then we're going to get the lowdown on the types, the textures, and what really works with your skin. So let's start with powder foundations. So the first powder foundation type is mineral foundation. Mineral foundation is super popular in the wake, I would say in the last half a decade of natural cosmetics. Mineral foundation can be in a loose form or it can be in a compact. And typically it has a light to medium coverage and it can be used on all skin types, normal, combination, and sensitive. The second powder foundation type is compact powder. And the compact powder foundation is usually fine milled and it goes on super, super smooth. It's great for normal skin. It's great for oily skin. The coverage that the compact powder foundation provides is actually buildable and it is popular because it gives a very nice matte finish. So especially for oily skin, it works because it takes away that shine, that unwanted shine that that's the Achilles heel. <laughs> so third powder foundation type is actually powder acne foundation. And as you can imagine, this foundation type is acne medicated to help with breakouts and blemishes. So it is super awesome for oily and combination skin. The last powder foundation type is cream to powder. And this foundation is easy to control as it goes on in a liquid cream state and dries like a powder finish. So this foundation type is great for normal to oily skin, and you can easily control the amount of coverage that you apply. Second foundation type is cream foundations. So cream foundations are very moisturizing and great. It's actually a perfect match for dry skin. The foundation is sold in compacts, jars, and bottles, and it gives your skin a dewy, radiant, and youthful look. Super, super awesome. Hold that thought. We'll be right back. Join the Pretty and Profiting Posse if you are a real deal woman entrepreneur creating wealth and making a global impact with your business. Represent yourself. Head on over to prettyandprofiting.com and get your merchandise. Profit in style. And we're back. So today we're talking about what foundation type is perfect for your skin. So we just finished talking about powder foundations and cream foundations. Next, we're going to talk about stick foundations. So stick foundation is great for getting lots of coverage on specific areas of your face. It's available in cream formats and matte versions, and your skin type should actually be considered before you make your final purchase. So the cream The cream stick foundation, great for dry skin. The matte stick foundation, great for oily skin. 
Lastly, we're going to talk about liquid foundations. So there, so there are about six liquid foundation types. I'm going to go through them so you can go to your local beauty store and buy your foundations in confidence. So the first liquid foundation type is long wearing foundation. Long wearing foundation doesn't break down with the oil on your skin during the day. And as a result, it stays put. So it's great for oily skin. With wearing long wearing foundation, it's really important to clean your face properly after wearing it all day. Illuminating foundation. Illuminating foundation gives your skin a dewy, youthful glow and is great for dry skin. This foundation is very popular because it gives dry skin what it's lacking. And also, a lot of brides love to wear illuminating foundation. Matte foundation. So matte foundation in liquid form is an oil-free formula that absorbs the oil and prevents shine. It works best with combination and oily skin, and you can also it can also be applied for heavier coverage in the case of covering breakouts and spots. Acne foundation. So acne foundation is a salicylic medicated foundation created to treat your skin while you wear makeup. It's often formulated to have a matte finish, so it absorbs the oil and works best on oily and breakout prone skin. Anti-aging foundation. So anti-aging foundation is a moisturizing foundation that helps to minimize fine lines and wrinkles. They have medium to full range coverage available and oftentimes it contains illuminating ingredients that help give dry skin a youthful glow. And lastly, tinted moisturizer. I love tinted moisturizer, especially in the summer. Tinted moisturizer foundation is a foundation mixed with moisturizer. They sell it in the stores, but honestly, you can take your current foundation and mix it with your skin moisturizer and voila. It's a light coverage and there's tons of options if you do go to the store. You can get it oil-free, you can get it with sunscreen, the options are limitless. So that's all about foundation perfection. When, we're, when you're a boss lady, when you're building your empire, it's so important that you step out like a boss. Having mismatched foundation is not going to work. You don't want to look like Casper. You don't want to look like a bear. You want it to be seamless. So when you speak, people are paying attention to your words and not holding back the shock in their face from mismatched makeup. It can be very traumatizing. So let's not do that. That's it for today's episode. This is your host, Nicole K. Lundy, and I will see you in the next episode. Thank you for tuning in to this episode of Pity and Profiting. Want to learn more about me and what I do? Head on over to ProfitablePersonalBrand.com. Also, I have a super juicy giveaway for one lucky show subscriber. If you want to enter, you just have to do two simple things. One, subscribe to the show. Two, leave a review on iTunes or Stitcher. And you'll be entered into this month's $25 Sephora gift card giveaway. Thank you for tuning in. Until next time, stay pretty and stack those profits. Thank you.